Hey you, Meow Kaiser coming at you today with a how to play guide to Laura. Laura is a very simple character. She has like a couple small things about her that makes her slightly like the difference between playing her optimally and playing her okay is like incredibly slight. And she doesn't even really reward you for playing her optimally, at least not in her current state. One of the things to keep in mind is that she is not a D plus start, like most of the cast. She starts D, but she makes up for it with her really high stat attack. If we take a look at her stat attack, uh, she's at 55.4 at level 18, and she starts level 1 at 18 stat attack. And it's actually even more than that technically, like by a small margin, only because of how her passive works. Her passive is Burglar Chick. Uh, Laura gains one of the bonus effects based on the number of epic items or above in her bag. At 0 to 1 items, she has accuracy plus 10%, total attack damage plus 3%. At 2 to 3 items, she has accuracy plus 5%, total attack damage plus 5%. And at 4 plus items, accuracy plus 3%, total attack damage plus 10%. The 0 to 1 items actually helps a lot with her early game contest because she will be triggering guard a lot less often because she has higher accuracy. Most people miss this. Epic or above, that includes legendary gear. Uh, this doesn't... Now, when it says that it's in her bag, it has to be in her bag. It cannot be equipped onto her. Anything that's equipped onto her does not count towards this bonus. So the thing to keep in mind about this ability is that as long as you're picking up, like, epic items or uh, legendary items off of corpses and just holding it in your bag, you can actually very easily get the 4 plus items bonus. And that total attack damage plus 10%, basically what that means for you is that the moment you hit SS... Most characters have to superhuman stack in order to get 300 stat attack. Uh, Laura just kind of gets 300 stat attack right off the bat. So this is something to be aware of. Pay attention to where people die. Try to pick up food first. And then if there's nothing else useful on the course, pick up like armor pieces as long as you have inventory space. And then her combat skill is casing the joints. It has a 60 second cooldown and on her next attack, she gets to see the content of the enemy bags and her attack damage is enhanced uh, based on the grade of each item in the bag, each item grants one, two, two, three, five bonus attack based on their grade. The bonus for items made of gold or gems is doubled. A thing to keep in mind is that uh, when you activate this ability, she only gains bonus attack for that one attack. And then you get to see all the items in the action log. This is actually very easily covered up by other events happening. So try to keep an eye on this. Uh, it helps you a lot in determining whether or not a fight is worth it for you. Because if you see a person like with like a ton of food in their bag, it's not you're you're going to know that they're going to fight you harder. So you may as well just leave if they're h hitting you harder. Uh, you have other situations where like if you don't have a lot of food, but then you put press casing the join, you see they don't have a lot of food. You know that they're going to leave. And then in the slight case, sometimes you see that your opponent is trying to build a second weapon, like really late into the game, or maybe they're like looking for a whetstone because they're carrying like raw tunas and stuff. Uh, try to pay attention to the contents in the action log. You can also open up uh, the log as well in game to kind of like take a look back on it and try to figure out what they're trying to do and see if you can deny it. Uh, if you're able to deny it, it helps you a lot in situations where like it's a 1v1 lobby. Other than that, she's a very basic character. She starts either blunt or throw. Most of the time you will be picking blunt over throw only because throw tends to just have a disadvantage in general unless you have supplies that kind of enabled it or if you're just a stronger player at playing throw in that case you'll be wanting to pick throw. In general she just does a lot better on blunt. With that out of the way let's get into it. Okay, listen, when you say balance is in terms of they are a average win rate, that doesn't mean people are going to play them, right? 
That's the reason why balance is such a tricky topic. Because unfortunately, it's just not that simple. Because you also want people to play the character. You don't want them just sitting in a garbage fire forever, you know? But they don't. Oh, okay. Potato. Here's the iron ore I needed. And another pickaxe. I'm gonna just take these and go. Hotel, probably. Everything's being made peace on today. We don't make Kundala here. It's just too much to carry. There's Jot. Yeah, you kind of just blew up.
Yeah, weapon rushing is not very good in this game at all. There's just so many mechanics that punish you for doing it. Like stone, please. Stone. Stone. Come on. Guess I just go here. Finish my build. Stone. There's the wooden fish. Prevented weapon from breaking. I was very early. Oh, you almost have no food. Okay. <laughs> Do I have a lighter yet? Cool. Awesome. Hey. Man, people still make baked potato? Wow. Whatever happened to french fry supremacy? Badly, 
use the wire. Every character you want to fight on as hard as you can without dying. So that's just fundamentally not understanding the game. What you just described. I mean, look how hard I fight. I'm not eating the potato. It's not happening, chat. That's unfortunate. Yeah. Unfortunate. What can you do? Oh god, no. Fine. Get in that hand mastery. Let's go. Kind of unfortunate how this played out, but whatever. It's fine. Can you scrap metal? There it is. Awesome. Everything's fine. I already forget where the the guy died. I feel like I already forgot where the heart died. Whoops.
Didn't she die at chapel? Am I crazy? I might be crazy. Was it only Wickline here? Ten tonic soup, braised burdock, grilled tuna. I see, but they're trying to make another weapon. So we're just not going to let them. We're going to sit on this. No, I see what you're trying to do. No, I know. I swear to God, if you peace zone this area. Okay, they did die here. Awesome. I need four items to activate that. An extra attack damage. Yay. Yay. Actually came. Mad man. Awesome. Okay, cool. I got a game that shows how to use our kit to the full extent. I could have grabbed this if I really wanted to. But I mean, having the minus 10% is also nice. Awesome.